okay hi everyone today and in this video I'm going to show you about the basic command line of the 40 gate fireball okay and then this is a step that we have to configure follow okay for the step one we have to set alien name okay alien name is mean set the uh, change the interval name okay and then for the step two allow all the protocol step three set the IP address by the command line Okay, all of step we have to the follow and we have to uh, configure by the command line in this video. Okay, one and two the five. Okay, for the step five, uh, if we call then uh, we configure on the GUI of the 40 gate because uh, complexity, okay, complicate, okay, for the configure uh, the ACP server. Uh, it if we call when you uh, we configure by the command line for the uh, GUI easy to configure but uh, for the command line uh, difficult to configure for the, the ACP server okay and then uh, I'm go to the firewall uh, for the get firewall in the uh, beam web host station okay okay this is the for the get firewall okay and then I'm logged into the for the get by the username admin and password no don't have it's been blame password okay before I'm show you the uh, basic how to configure uh, command line in the for the get okay for the step follow our step okay I'm re uh, reset all the commit uh, I'm uh, go to the reset all the configuration that I'm uh, config configure before okay when you want to reset a uh, factory Default configuration you can try the command execute okay factory reset okay and then you can enter okay try the Y for the yes okay system is resetting to the factory default okay let's boot the system for the get firewall okay for the for the get firewall is the firewall that the popular The most of the company use the 40 gate firewall for uh, for the protect prevent prevent of the for the security. Okay, my company use use also for the 40 gate. Okay, system is done. Okay, okay, and then you can type the, the pass uh, the user admin. Okay, for the password blank. Okay, and then we, we follow our step. The first step, uh, we set alien name. Okay. Uh, port one. Okay. Okay, this is the alien name. Okay. Okay, this is al 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 alien name. Okay. For the port one to the internal, port two for where. Okay. Okay. Before set the alien name, I'm um, show uh, in the first name and IP address we configure or not. Okay. You can type the command so interface system interface and then enter. Okay. Okay. This is the by default of the port. Okay. Okay. Port one, two, three, four until the ten port. Okay. Okay, for the IP address, we not get to assign. Okay, for the alias name, we not we not get to set for the port one to the internal or when we not get to configure. Okay, by default we have a ten port. Okay, for the for the get. Okay, and then I'm go to the set the alias name for the port one and assign IP uh, for the port one and port two and allow all the protocol access. Example. As a internet HTTP uh, HTTPS. Then we follow our step. Okay, step one, step two, three, four, five. Okay. Okay, and then I'm going to the like, config system interface. Enter edit. Okay, port. Okay, edit port. I'm um, going to set the alias name. Okay, 
channel okay and then I'm uh, allow all the flow to go allow access okay you can tap uh, space tap space tap space tap space tap okay okay this is uh, allow the flow to go for the step 2 okay and then we go to uh, step IP address for the step 3 okay set IP address on the port 1 okay for the IP address okay this is IP address for the port 1 internal port 2 for the web okay okay so that map okay and then set uh, okay then you can show configuration that we configure Okay, you can see set IP address. Okay, allow the protocol. Okay, and set alias name in the node. Okay, and then you can uh, tie. You can press C for the this one, this symbol. Okay. Okay, you can see the all the configure configuration in the port one. Okay, we can config set and set get. Okay, this is the command have do. Okay. So information of the configure command. Uh, so of uh, so in the in the information of the command that we have to configure in the port one. Okay. So you can uh, show the full configuration. Okay. Show the full configuration. Okay. okay. You see the detail of the of the information of the port one. Okay. Okay, then we go to the port um, tie the N for the common cell. Okay, N is mean the cell, the last configuration. Okay. Okay, and then I'm go to the uh, port two and uh, set a layer name for the when and set set IP address also. Okay, system. configure system request. Edit okay for two okay and then I'm set alias name when okay and then I set allow or protocol okay and then I set IP address for the when port okay something mark to work by to work by and then you can show okay. as you see this is the information for the port 2 that we have to configure okay this is the IP address for the port 2 hello or the protocol and set a legend name okay then you can find the command end for the cell last configuration okay and then you can show the system in the frame you will to store all information detail for the port all the port okay that you see port 1 this is the IP address for the port 1 okay this is the port, port 2 IP address for the port 2 okay port 1 internal port and when port for alias name of the port 1 internal of the port 2 alias name when okay okay for the for the step 3 we already okay, and then we go to step 4 set DNS server okay okay before you set DNS server I'm trying to recommend so system DNS for the want to know about the DNS server detail DNS okay okay this is the default of the DNS server from the for the gate okay uh, and then I'm no need um, no need to the DNS server uh, I'm going to set the new DNS server okay from our DNS server okay eight 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 this is a DNS, a DNS server from the Google that we have to replace from the pool of the uh, of the for the gate DNS so you can type in configure system DNS. Okay, and then it 
okay, then set okay, primary okay, and then one more secondary okay, and then so okay, that you see this is the primary and secondary that we reflect from the pole of the uh, need a server of the body gap okay, and then you can run pi show uh, system DMS. okay okay for the step 4 we already and then we put the step 5 and the body ACP and configure IP rank for the DACP server okay for the step 5 uh, if we show to configure the ACP server by the command line Okay, and the ACP server in the GUI of the project get easy to configure for the command line difficult. Okay, and then I'm going to the step one show you. Okay, you can type the command. Uh, okay, I'm show the ACP server. So system ACP server. Okay, so we we don't have any the ACP server, so we have to enable configure system the ACP server and enter okay and then you want to know about the information in the, the ACP server you press it and uh, slash okay this one slash okay so you can see the information edit delete okay or something common okay then you can type command edit okay and then sys slash Okay, did one more. Okay, and sys loss. Okay, did one more. Okay, and then uh, for the edit, and you can tie the number of the ID. Example for me, tie one. Okay, and then you can sys press sys and come uh, this uh, command. Okay, that you see, configure, configure, and set. Okay, this is a command that we have to enable for the ACP server and configure uh, IP address for rank. Okay, and then I'm go to the configure first, and then uh, go to the uh, set for the scan. Okay, for first, I'm go to the configure. Okay, IP rank. Okay, then enter. Okay, edit. Okay, one. Okay, and then I'm um, tie the start IP set start IP address. Okay, for the IP address range. Okay, we follow IP address start from the this IP to the app IP address. Okay. Start. Okay, and then step end. Okay, one one five. Okay, and then show. Okay, this is a IP range that we set. Okay, start from this IP and to end. Start and end. Okay. Okay, and then and argument end for the sale situation. Okay, and then uh, you go to the set. Okay, before gateway. Okay, this is the default gateway for the internal IP also. The same internal IP also. Okay, and then set DNS server 1. DNS server 1, okay. DNS server 1, DNS server 2, eh? Okay, set. Okay. Okay, and then you enable set enable the ACP server. Okay, and then set uh, the ACP server allow to the the VLAN in the first port one in the port for internal port. Okay. Okay, and then set uh, server tie. Uh, Okay, and then net 
This is a, a gateway. Okay, this is a port. We assign the DHP to server to this port, port 1. Okay, this is the rank of the IP address, start and end. Okay, this is a subnet map. Okay, this is a DNS server. Okay, DNS server only one. Okay, okay shut again. Server one, okay, server two, server two, okay, this is server two, server three, okay. So, okay, let me see. Okay, and then you can type command N for the cell, the configuration. Okay, so DHCP system. Okay, DHCP server. Okay, okay, this is the configuration and information that we, we configured before. Okay, for the gateway, port, the address, and submit my uh, unit server. Okay. Then we can go to the video client SP1 for the release IP got the DHP or not from the for the game. Then we go to review, get the IP address from the DHCP server or not. Okay. Okay, did you see? Okay, this is a. Uh, uh, the ACP server from the client that get from the uh, got from the the ACP server okay. in this rank okay in this rank okay and then we we can check on the uh, this one okay but you see okay this okay the DNS server okay Okay, it already for the IP address from the DHCP server to the uh, window client SP2. Okay, and then for the in this video, I'm um, finish or finish. Okay, this is a uh, basic of the configure firewall for the gate. I hope all you clearly. Okay, don't forget help me to like, comment, share, and subscribe on my channel also. Okay, thank you for watching.